Welcome back to Golden Dragon Games. I'm your host, Rocky2815, and today we are playing through Pokemon Ruby version, the original. So, let's get this show on the road and start a new game. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch. But everybody calls me the Pokemon Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. The world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times as friends, playmates and at times as uh, cooperative workmates and sometimes we band together and battle others but despite our closeness we don't know everything about Pokemon in fact there are many many secrets surrounding Pokemon to unravel Pokemon mysteries I've undertaken research in research that's that's what I do in three, two, one. It must be trying riding with our things in the moving truck. Yes, it is. Why were we even in the back of the truck? But anyway, well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? This is um. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Rocky. Let's go inside. Right, let's see what's in here. See, Rocky, isn't it nice in here too? The movers Pokemon do all the work of, of moving us and cleaning up after. This is so comforting. Rocky, your room is upstairs. Go and check it out, dear. Dad bought you a new clock to mark our move here. Don't forget to set it. Here's the moving... What are these Pokemon called again? I know I'm going to get this wrong. Machoke? Or Machop? I think these are Machops. Because Machokes are the ones with... The forearms, aren't they? I think so. Somebody please correct me in the comments down below. Anyway, what is he saying? I can't read that. Oh, here's a TV. A GameCube. It's a Nintendo GameCube. A Game Boy Advance is connected to servers at the controller. Dad might like this program. Better get going. This clock is stopped. Better set it and start it. Right. Now the time is... Currently... 7.25. So... I shall be back in a minute. Okay, just done the clock. Rocky, how do you like your new room? Good, everything's put away neatly. Then finish moving everything in downstairs, too. Pokemon movers are so... I don't know what that says. Oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. What? Rocky flips open the notebook. Adventures rule. Note 1. Open the menu with start. Adventures rule 2. Record your progress with save. The reminder... The remaining pages are blank. Rocky took a closer look 
at the Hoenn region map. There it is, the Hoenn region map. Mind you, it's going to be changing so much when Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire come out. Rocky boosts up the PC. What would you like to do, sir? Item storage, mailbox. Can't read that or turn off. Uh, let's check item storage. Withdraw, potion. Good, good. Turn it off. Just have a little sleep. <laughs> Oh, that was a good sleep. Right, let's go downstairs. Oh. Oh, Rocky, Rocky, quickly, come quickly. Look, it's Petalburg Gym. Maybe Dad will be on. Interviewer, we bring you this report from in front of the Petalburg Gym. Oh, it's over. I think Dad was on, but we missed him. Too bad. Oh, yes. One of Dad's friends lives in town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. All right. Let's go and introduce ourselves. Now, I think this is his house. Ah, yeah. Oh, hello, and you are? Oh, you're Rocky, our new next-door neighbour. Hi. We have a daughter about the same age as you. Our daughter was excited about making a new friend. Our daughter is upstairs, I think. Right, let's see who this person is. Oh, it's May, of course. Pokemon fully restored, items ready, and... Huh? Who? Who are you? I'm Doctor Who. Get it? Mwah, mwah, mwah. Oh. You're Rocky. So... Your... Move was today? Hmm. I may. Glad to meet you. I have this dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. I I heard about you, Rocky, from my dad, Professor Birch. Her dad's Professor Birch? Wow. I forgot about that. I haven't played this game in such a long time, you see. I was hoping that you would be nice, Rocky, and that we could be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I... Uh, I've just met you, Rocky. <laughs> what was that? Oh, no, I forgot. I was supposed to help my dad catch some wild Pokemon. Rocky, I'll catch you later. <sighs> my voice is going to be gone by the end of this recording. I'm sure of it. Let's see now, this is the professor's lab. Nope, nothing in here. I guess we better go and see if he's available elsewhere. I can hear someone shouting down the road here. What should I do? What should we do? Somebody has to go and help. Don't worry, I'm coming to rescue. Help me! Really? Hello! You, over here, please help! In my bag, there's a Pokeball! Oh... Who should we pick? Trico, Torch Chick, or Mudkip? Torch Chick. Yes.
while Pucci Ain Iena appeared, go torch trick, and I just realised that I didn't actually have the sound on for that bit, so uh, I'm really not wanting to re-record because my throat is going, so I'll see if I can slip some background music of my own in. Apologies for that. But anyway, let's get on with this. Fight. Dot chick, you scratch. Oh yeah. Oh, scratch again. Yes. Walt Pucciana fainted. Dot chick gained 15 EXP power. Uh, points, not power. Professor Birch. Phew! I was in the tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're Rocky. This is no place to cat chat. So come back to my Pokemon lab later, okay? One minute later. Professor Birch. So, Rocky, I've heard so much about you from your father. I heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. By the way, you battled earlier. You pulled it off with... What does that say? Ah. I can't read that. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins. Hang on. Does that mean the, the guy who's the leader of the Pelberg Gym is our dad? Wow. I really forgot loads about Gen 3. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh, yes. As thank you for rescuing me. Oh, i like you to have the Pokemon that you used earlier. Rocky received the Torch Chick. Professor Birch, while you're at it, why don't you give it a nickname? Well, we can always change it back later, so I'm going to call it Flare. Uh... F, uh, L, and on just a minute, I've gone out to spell flare. Okay, I'm back and I know how to spell. Okay, so A, A, a minute, that L's a capital. It's not right. F, L, a Ari R E Professor Birch, if you work at Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make a darn good trainer. My kid May is out on Route 103 studying Pokemon. It might not be a bad idea for you to go and see May. What do you think? Yes. Great. May should be happy too. Get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. Then we get our Pokedex. See if we... Uh, let's try in here. How are you doing, Rocky? You look a little tired. I think you should... Healing the Pokemon. Take care, honey. Let's go to Route 103, which is just up here. Uh, dead end town. Uh, I thought she was supposed to be on Route 103. Maybe Route 103 is a bit further. Ah, here it is. Oh, it's a Pokemon battle. 
Who's it gonna be? It's a zigzag zoo. <laughs> Go flare. Scratch. Scratch again. Come on, we can take this. Oh, it used growl. My attack fell. No mind. Scratch again. One more time should do it. I swear the Pucciana went down in less hits than this. Mind you, it might have been a lower level. I'll have to check back on recording. Okay. 34 XP. Level 6. Let's go up here and see if we can find May. Because she is meant to be on this. There you are. May, let's see the Pokemon found on Route 103 include. Oh, hi, Rocky. Oh, I see my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is like. <laughs> Trainer May would like to battle. Trainer May set out Mudkip. Scratch. Scratch. Now, for gone, does Tekel have a bigger base? power than Scratch. I might need to check that later. Mind you, we won't have Scratch for too long. You should be able to get rid of it by six episodes. I always think it had. Oh. Uh, I, I'm going to use our potion here because we're on such low health and mod kit yeah, Mudkip would have easily had got us then, so... Yes! Level 7. Or, uh, no, Focus Energy. Wonder what that attack does. Wow, that's great, Rocky. You're pretty good. Rocky got 300... Poke dollars, I guess they're called, for winning. May, I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, but it's already like you might be able to be best friends any kind of Pokemon easily. Well, it's time to head back to the lab. Oops. So we have to go all the way back to the lab now. Great. Oh, Rocky, over here. Let's hurry home. Oh, <laughs> that's just basically a shortcut. So we don't have to actually go into tall grass. Now, where has she gone? Has she gone? Yeah. Probably. Professor Birch. Oh, hi, Rocky. I heard you beat May on your first try. That's excellent. Really? May's been helping me with my research for a long time. May has a... X... Okay, I can't read that word either. History... It as a Pokemon train already. Here, Rocky, I ordered this from my research. But I think you should have it. This Pokedex. Rocky received the Pokedex. Professor Birch, the Pokedex is a high technology tool that automatically makes a recording of any Pokemon you meet or catch. My kids may goes everywhere with it. However, my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records its date in the Pokedex. Why, May? 
looks for me while I'm doing field work and shows me. Oh wow, Rocky, you've got a Pokedex too. That's great, just like me. I've got uh, something for you too. Obtained the Pokeball. Rocky put the Pokeball away in the ball pocket. It's fun if you can get a lot of Pokemon. I'm going to look all over the place because I want different Pokemon. If I find any cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Okay. Do we... Right. Let's... Ah. Wait, Rocky. Rocky, Rocky, did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? What an adorable Pokemon! You got it from Professor Birch! How nice! What are you talking about? You just healed it about five minutes ago. Your... Your father's child, alright? You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey, if you're going to go out on adventure... Wear these running shoes. They put a zip in your step. Rocky switch shoes. Rocky, these shoes came with instructions. Press B while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Slip these running shoes and race in the great outdoors. To think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed, but please be careful, if anything happens, you can come home. Go on, get them honey. Yeah, okay. I guess we go on our Pokemon journey. Leave it there, because I've been recording for 11 whole minutes, so... Between this episode and the next episode, I'll find out how to get the map, and we'll reconvene here, so... Well, thank you everybody for watching my first episode of my brand new series of Pokemon Ruby version. So, until next time... Bye, And my throat's killing me!